Hello Moonbeams. This reading is for my mamas and future mamas, okay? So we're gonna dive right in. This reading is not gonna be too long. I did do a short for this video as well. So those who like shorts, you could check that out. Um, and pile number one, we have inducing labor. We have visiting you in your dreams. We have Aries baby, so you could be an Aries, your baby could be an Aries, dad could be a, ba uh, a Aries, or you could conceive in um, Aries season. It says delays due to free will and choices. So maybe this is why your baby's uh, labor has to be induced because your baby is not uh, coming on time. And then it says, uh, pregnancy pillow will keep you comfortable while you sleep, okay? So for pile number one, these are the few cards that was in there. I'm going to shuffle some more cards for pile number one, okay? So any more information for people, yep, in pile number one, okay? So people who chose pile number one, you may experience back pain, okay? Some of you need to take a test now. Some of you may be feeling the pregnancy symptoms now. Some of you may be Capricorns. Um, you may conceive in Capricorn season, which is here pretty much. Um, dad may be Capricorn, you know, or you may have a Capricorn, uh, baby. For some of you, you're going to have a pregnancy buddy. So one of your friends is going to be pregnant, um, while you are, or it could be a family member. For some of you, you're going to have a baby girl. For some of you, a lot of you, um, I read your messages, so I know this baby is gonna make you really, really happy. Your baby wants to thank you for always being there for them. It's very important that you exercise and stay active during this pregnancy, pile number one. This one says feet casting and memory keepsake. So some of you are going to be doing that. Some of you are going to actually have water births. And some of you are going to have baby boys. Okay, so this is all pile number one. Pile number two says still in the spirit realm, uh, waiting for the right time. So for some of you, this is why you haven't gotten pregnant yet, because your baby's waiting for the right time. Some of you will be having an angel baby. Some of you are Aquariuses, or you're going to get pregnant in Aquarius season. Your baby's going to be an Aquarius, or dad's an Aquarius. For some of you, this, is going, this pregnancy is going to be major shifts and transformation which all mean good things. They don't mean anything bad. It just means that you're coming into the season of rewards. Um, I've been speaking about this um, in posts and on my uh, sites and stuff like that. This baby is going to be very happy and content. Let's see what other messages your baby has for pal number two. Okay. Pile number two, you may have to, or you may um, take a blood test, and that may be how you find out you're pregnant. You definitely need to take those prenatal vitamins. Some of you are preparing by watching videos. Some of you are Scorpios. You will have a Scorpio baby, dad's a Scorpio, or you will get uh, pregnant next year in Scorpio season. Your partner is going to be very supportive of this pregnancy. Okay, your baby in the universe is saying that make sure you eat very healthy. 
your baby is going to have the cutest dimples. Some of you will have the chance of conception in spring. Um, some of you may have a positive pregnancy test now, so congrats. Again, dad is going to be a big help. A lot of you guys will be having that baby shower. You might be having one this weekend, you know. And a lot of you are setting up that room. So some of you who are watching this, you're definitely already pregnant. Um, some of you have the chance to uh, conceive in the summer. And some of you, that confirmation, um, your cancers, your baby's going to be a cancer, dad is a cancer, or you're going to conceive in this season, which is the summer. We just came out of Cancer Moon, so that's a really cute and perfect sign. All right, so pile number three, we have memories, uh, keepsake hand casting, because you really want to um, remember these moments, right? You've been waiting so long. So for some of you, um, your baby's going to be musically talented. For some of you, you are Gemini's. Um, we have the summer again because we have May and June, so the double confirmation. Um, so you may get pregnant in this time, dad may be born in this time, or your baby may be born in that time. This is definitely going to be a healthy pregnancy, so don't worry. And then we have, uh, I'll be a little shy and quiet. So you're not going to really have a loud baby. Alright, see what other messages your baby has for you. And I'm not trying to rush through this reading. I just have, um, I have to go to the church to like do candle lightings for people who are sick, um, for people who are dying, for the ill. So I have to go out and do my deeds. So, but I wanted to make sure I got you guys uh, a reading today. Some of you are definitely going to have a little girl. Um, for you who have lost your babies, your baby is always with you, so they want you to know that, pile number three. Um, your, <laughs> the baby's grandparents are going to spoil them crazy, okay, which is expected. Um, this group, pile three, some of you will be having a hospital birth. Some of you may experience postpartum depression, so make sure you reach out to your family or someone who will listen to you and help you. Um, here at the Brujas Lair, we always help our clients with anything, so if you need us, please let us know. All right, Symbolation of Rainbow Baby is coming back. You guys are going to have the best um, family time. Some of you may be taking that test now, and it's going to come out negative because right now is not the time. Some of you are going to have mild complications, but it's nothing to worry about. Pile number three, a lot of you are going to have twins. And your baby is going to love to snuggle. Just make sure that, you know, the animals don't cause any breathing problems. Okay, so I hope you guys love this reading. It was really quick, but... um. I wanted to give you guys something because I do have uh, a lot of other obligations today. I have to get to work and um, I have to get to the church to help um, those in need as well. So I love you guys. Thank you guys for following me, subscribing to my channel. Thank you guys for booking your readings with me. I love when you guys book. Thank you for buying my products. Um, thank you for just being you, you know, and making the Bruja's Lair a part of your life. I really do appreciate each and every one of you. Again, if you need me, my contact information will be below in the description box. Um, I guess I'll see you later, Moonbeam, so um, in my next video. Bye.